so now in this question is asking identify the correct statement from the following four statements are given to us and we have to find out the correct statement right first is blister copper has blister appearance due to evolution of co2 absolutely wrong second is vapor phase refining is carried out for nickel by van arkel method no it's it's by mons process right and third one is pig iron can be molded into a variety of shapes that is absolutely correct means the third one is the correct answer so the correct answer is option number three let's move on to the next question so now this is the question from the chapter equilibrium it's given hydrolysis of sucrose given by the following reaction sucrose is hydrolyzing giving us glucose and fructose and the equilibrium constant is given that is 2 into 10 to the power 13 and we have to find out delta g naught of this particular reaction at 300 kelvin four options are given to us and we have to find out the correct answer so it's a simple question from equilibrium so the solution will be delta g naught is equal to minus 2.303 rt log kc we all know that right now this 2.303 and log this will become natural log right so we can write it like minus rt ln kc now putting the values it will be minus 8.314 this is the value of r multiplied by the temperature that is 300 multiplied by the natural log of kc and kc is 2 into 10 to the power 13 right it means that the fourth one is the correct answer right let's move on to the next question so this is a question from the chapter chemical bonding and the molecular structure and the topic is molecular orbital theory and is asking identify the molecule which does not exist so we have to find out the bond order first so the solution we know that bond order is equal to the number of electrons which are present in the bonding orbitals minus number of electrons present in the anti-bonding orbitals divided by 2 and in the case of helium if you take this he2 in this case we have four electrons and its electronic configuration will be sigma 1s2 sigma anti-bonding 1s2 so how many electrons in bonding orbital 2 anti-bonding 2 so the bond order will be 2 minus 2 by 2 is equal to 0 that's why he2 will not exist that's why this fourth he2 will be our answer right let's move on to the next question